The Ehrenfest theorem, named after Paul Ehrenfest, an Austrian theoretical physicist at Leiden University, relates the time derivative of the expectation values of the position and momentum operators x and p to the expectation value of the force f equals minus v x display style f equals v x on a massive particle moving in a scalar potential v x display style v x although at first glance it might appear that the Ehrenfest theorem is saying that the quantum mechanical expectation values obey Newton's classical equations of motion this is not actually the case if the pair x p display style langle x wrangle langle p wrangle were to satisfy newton's second law the right hand side of the second equation would have to be minus v x display style v left left langle x right wrangle right which is typically not the same as minus v x display style left langle v x right wrangle if for example the potential v x display style v x is cubic ie proportional to x 3 display style x caret 3 then v display style v is quadratic proportional to x 2 display style x caret 2 this means in the case of newton's second law the right side would be in the form of x 2 display style langle x wrangle caret 2 while in the ehrenfest theorem it is in the form of x 2 display style langle x caret 2 wrangle the difference between these two quantities is the square of the uncertainty in x display style x and is therefore non zero an exception occurs in case when the classical equations of motion are linear that is when v display style v is quadratic and v display style v is linear in that special case v x display style v left left langle x right wrangle right and v x display style left langle v x right wrangle do agree Thus, for the case of a quantum harmonic oscillator, the expected position and expected momentum do exactly follow the classical trajectories. For general systems, if the wave function is highly concentrated around a point x 0 then v x display style v left left langle x right wrangle right and v x display style left langle v x right wrangle will be almost the same since both will be approximately equal to v x 0 display style v x underscore 0 in that case, the expected position and expected momentum will approximately follow the classical trajectories, at least for as long as the wave function remains localized in position. The Ehrenfest theorem is a special case of a more general relation between the expectation of any quantum mechanical operator and the expectation of the commutator of that operator with the Hamiltonian of the system, where A is some quantum mechanical operator and A is its expectation value. This more general theorem was not actually derived by Ehrenfest it is due to Werner Heisenberg. It is most apparent in the Heisenberg picture of quantum mechanics, where it is just the expectation value of the Heisenberg equation of motion. It provides mathematical support to the correspondence principle. 
The reason is that Ehrenfest's theorem is closely related to Liouville's theorem of Hamiltonian mechanics, which involves the Poisson bracket instead of a commutator. Dirac's rule of thumb suggests that statements in quantum mechanics which contain a commutator correspond to statements in classical mechanics where the commutator is supplanted by a Poisson bracket multiplied by E. This makes the operator expectation values obey corresponding classical equations of motion, provided the Hamiltonian is at most quadratic in the coordinates and momenta. Otherwise, the evolution equations still may hold approximately, provided fluctuations are small. <laughs> <laughs> Derivation in the Schrödinger picture Suppose some system is presently in a quantum state phi. If we want to know the instantaneous time derivative of the expectation value of A, that is, by definition, d d t a equals d d t phi a phi d x Three equals phi t a phi d x three plus phi a t phi d x three plus phi phi t d x 3 equals phi t a phi d x 3 plus a t plus phi a phi t dx 3 display style begin aligned frac mathrm d mathrm d t langle a wrangle and equals frac mathrm d mathrm d t int phi caret asterisk a phi mathrm d x caret 3 and equals int left frac partial phi caret asterisk partial t right a phi mathrm d x caret 3 plus int phi caret asterisk left frac partial a partial T right phi mathrm d x caret three plus int phi caret asterisk at left frac partial phi partial t right mathrm d x caret three and equals int left frac partial phi caret asterisk partial t right a phi mathrm d x caret three plus left langle frac partial a partial t right wrangle plus int phi caret asterisk at left frac partial phi partial t right math from d x caret 3 end aligned where we are integrating over all space if we apply the schrodinger equation we find that phi t equals 1 i h phi display style frac partial phi partial t equals frac 1 i h bar h phi by taking the complex conjugate we find phi t equals minus 1 i phi h equals minus 1 i phi h Display style frac partial phi caret asterisk partial t equals frac one i h bar phi caret asterisk h caret asterisk equals frac one i h bar phi caret asterisk h. Note h equals h because the Hamiltonian is Hermitian. Placing this into the above equation, we have d d t a equals one I Phi A H minus H A Phi D X three plus T equals 
1 i a h plus a t display style frac d dt langle a wrangle equals frac 1 i h bar int phi caret asterisk aha phi tilde dx caret 3 plus left langle frac partial a partial t right wrangle equals frac 1 i h bar langle a h wrangle plus left langle frac partial a partial t right wrangle Often, but not always, the operator a is time independent, so that its derivative is zero, and we can ignore the last term. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Derivation in the Heisenberg picture. In the Heisenberg picture, the derivation is trivial. The Heisenberg picture moves the time dependence of the system to operators instead of state vector. Starting with the Heisenberg equation of motion d d t a t equals a t t plus one i a t h Display style frac d d t a t equals frac partial a t partial t plus frac one i h b a r a t h. We can derive Ehrenfest's theorem simply by projecting the Heisenberg equation onto psi. Display style psi wrangle from the right and psi. Display style langle psi. From the left, or taking the expectation value, so psi d d t a t psi equals psi a t t psi plus psi one i a T H Psi Display style left Langle Psi left frac D D T A T right Psi right Wrangle equals left Langle Psi left frac partial A T partial T right Psi right Wrangle plus left Langle Psi left frac one I H B A R A T H right Psi right Wrangle we can pull the d, dt out of the first term since the state vectors are no longer time dependent in the Heisenberg picture. Therefore, d, d, t, a, t equals a, t, t plus 1 i, a, t h display style frac d dt langle a t wrangle equals left langle frac partial a t partial t right wrangle plus frac 1 i h b a r left langle a t h right wrangle topic general example The expectation values of the theorem, however, are the very same in the Schrödinger picture as well. For the very general example of a massive particle moving in a potential, the Hamiltonian is simply h x p t equals p two two m plus v x t display style h x p t equals frac p caret 2 2 meters plus v x t where x is the position of the particle suppose we wanted to know the instantaneous change in momentum p using Ehrenfest's theorem we have d d t p equals one I P H 
plus p t equals 1 i p v x t Display style frac d d t langle p wrangle equals frac one i h b a r langle p h wrangle plus left langle frac partial p partial t right wrangle equals frac one i h b a r langle p v x t wrangle. Since the operator p commutes with itself and has no time dependence. By expanding the right hand side, replacing p by minus i, we get d d t p equals phi v x t x phi d x minus phi x v x t phi D X Display style frac D D T Langle P Wrangle equals int phi carrot asterisk V X T frac partial partial X phi tilde D X int phi carrot asterisk frac partial partial X V X T phi tilde D X tilde After applying the product rule on the second term, we have D D T P equals phi v x t x phi d x minus phi x v x t phi d x minus phi v x t x phi d x equals minus phi x v x t phi d x equals minus x v x t equals f display style begin aligned frac d d t langle p wrangle and equals int phi caret asterisk v x t frac partial partial x phi tilde d x int phi caret asterisk left frac partial partial x v x t right phi tilde d x int phi caret asterisk v x t frac partial partial x phi tilde dx and equals int phi caret asterisk left frac partial partial x v x t right phi tilde dx and equals left langle frac partial partial x v x t right wrangle equals langle f wrangle end aligned. As explained in the introduction, this result does not say that the pair x p display style langle x wrangle langle p wrangle satisfies Newton's second law because the right hand side of the formula is f x t display style langle f x t wrangle rather than f x t display style f langle x wrangle t Nevertheless, as explained in the introduction, for states that are highly localized in space, the expected position and momentum will approximately follow classical trajectories, which may be understood as an instance of the correspondence principle. Similarly, we can obtain the instantaneous change in the position expectation value. d d t x equals 1 i x h plus x t equals 1 i x p 2 2 m plus v x t plus Zero equals one I 
x p 2 2 m equals 1 i 2 m x p d d p p 2 equals 1 i 2 meters i 2 p equals 1 meter p display style begin aligned frac d dt langle x wrangle and equals frac 1 i h bar langle x h wrangle plus left langle frac partial x partial t right wrangle and equals frac 1 i h bar left langle left x frac p carrot 2 2 meters plus v x t right right wrangle plus o and equals frac 1 i h bar Left Langle, left x, frac p carrot two, two meters right, right, wrangle and equals frac one i h bar two meters left Langle x, p, frac d, dp, p carrot two, right, wrangle and equals frac one i h bar two meters Langle i h bar two p, wrangle and equals frac one m Langle p, wrangle end aligned. This result is actually in exact accord with the classical equation. Topic: Derivation of the Schrödinger equation from the Ehrenfest theorems. It was established above that the Ehrenfest theorems are consequences of the Schrödinger equation. However, the converse is also true: the Schrödinger equation can be inferred from the Ehrenfest theorems. We begin from m d d t. Psi T X carrot Psi T equals Psi T P carrot Psi T D D T Psi T P carrot Psi t equals psi t minus v x caret psi t display style begin aligned m frac d dt left langle psi t right hat x left psi t right wrangle and equals left langle psi t right hat p left psi t right wrangle frac d dt left langle psi t right hat p left psi t right wrangle and equals left langle psi t right v hat x left psi t right wrangle end aligned applications of the product rule leads to d psi d t x caret psi plus psi x caret d psi D T equals Psi P carrot M Psi D Psi D T P carrot Psi plus Psi P carrot D Psi D T equals Psi minus V x carrot Psi display style begin aligned left Langle frac D Psi D T big hat x big Psi right wrangle plus left Langle Psi big hat x big frac D Psi D T right wrangle and equals left Langle Psi big frac hat P M big Psi right wrangle left Langle frac D Psi D T big hat P big Psi right wrangle plus left Langle psi big hat p big frac d psi d t right wrangle and equals langle psi v hat x psi wrangle end aligned here apply Stone's theorem using h to denote the quantum generator of time translation. 
The next step is to show that this is the same as the Hamiltonian operator used in quantum mechanics. Stone's theorem implies I, d psi dt equals h caret, psi t, display style I h bar left, frac d psi dt right wrangle equals hat h psi t wrangle tilde, where h was introduced as a normalization constant to the balance dimensionality. Since these identities must be valid for any initial state, the averaging can be dropped and the system of commutator equations for h are derived I M H carrot X carrot equals P carrot I H carrot P carrot equals minus V X carrot Display style m hat h hat x equals h bar hat p q quad i hat h hat p equals h bar v hat x. Assuming that observables of the coordinate and momentum obey the canonical commutation relation x p equals e. Setting h caret equals h x caret P carrot display style hat h equals h hat x hat p. The commutator equations can be converted into the differential equations m h x p p equals p h x p x equals v x display style m frac partial h x p partial p equals p q quad frac partial h x p partial x equals v x whose solution is the familiar quantum hamiltonian h caret equals p caret 2 2 m plus v x caret display style hat h equals frac hat p caret 2 2 meters plus v hat x. Whence the Schrödinger equation was derived from the Ehrenfest theorems by assuming the canonical commutation relation between the coordinate and momentum. If one assumes that the coordinate and momentum commute, the same computational method leads to the Koopman von Neumann classical mechanics, which is the Hilbert space formulation of classical mechanics. Therefore, this derivation as well as the derivation of the Koopman von Neumann mechanics shows that the essential difference between quantum and classical mechanics reduces to the value of the commutator. Notes <laughs>